Wake up. It's time to kickstart your day with Scripture Link's Daily Dose of Inspiration. Daily Dose of Inspiration. Good morning and welcome to this brand new day. This is Scripture Link's Daily Dose of Inspiration for Friday, September 14th, 2018. And as you get up and you start this brand new day, give God praise this day. Take this day and just give Him praise for the things that He's done in your life. Today's scripture reading is taken from the book of 1 Timothy, chapter number 4, and it's verse number 12. The scripture says, Let no man despise thy youth, but be thou an example of the believers in word, in conversation, in charity, in spirit, in faith, in purity. Friends, Paul's given Timothy some practical advice on what he needs to do as a minister, and I think that that practical advice can trickle down to you and me in how we need to be living in our society. He tells Timothy, who was a young man at this time, to to let no one despise you because of his youth. We need to make sure people don't despise us because of our faith. We need to make sure people don't despise us because we may be young in the faith or or. We gotta make sure people don't despise us in our faith. He says, but be an example of the believers. And he gives several areas that we need to look at here, that we need to be the example in. The first one is in word, and that's our conversations. What comes out of your mouth today? In the book of James, James says, can salt water and fresh water flow from the same spring? No, it can't. So if we're praising God with our lips, then we shouldn't be cursing our brothers at the same time. So what words, how, how is your conversation, how is your words? Is your words building others up or are they tearing people down? Second area he talks about is conversation, and here he's talking about our conduct. How do we conduct ourselves? Do we conduct ourselves different from the way everybody else conducts themselves? Do we go around telling the same dirty jokes, spreading the same gossip? Do we go around with an attitude that that I'm better than everybody else? How do you conduct yourself? Do you put that wall around you that people can't come up to you? Or do you do you conduct yourselves in such a way that's God glorifying? Then he says in charity or in love, do we love other people? That's a big one right there. Do we, even more specific, do we love those who don't love us? Then he says in faith or in spirit, which is a proper attitude. What kind of attitude do you have? Have you ever come across somebody that just has such a repulsive attitude that you can't stand to be around them? Is that the way you are? And he says in faith, trusting God, trusting him, having the faith to know that God is who he said he is and that you're going to trust him no matter what goes on. And finally, impurity or integrity is what that would be. Integrity. Are you living your life in, with integrity, with honesty, with, with, in such a way that people look at you and they say, hey, his word is good as gold. Friends, use those areas today and try and make sure that you're being the example in each one of those areas. And if there's an area that you're not being the example in, ask God to show it to you and then commit to changing and trying to be the example that we need to be. Think about that as you go through this day. And remember, get into God's word and allow God's word to get into you and then share that word with someone today. Have a blessed day. (music) 